I'm here and welcome to Thrivecart. This is a software that's coming out and I'm excited about this because it's not like other softwares that I usually introduce you to. The reason is that it hasn't launched yet and this isn't the launch of it. Uh, Josh Barlett is a good friend of mine. He's the creator of Easy Video Suite, Easy Video Player and when I saw Thrivecart I asked him if I could do something really special and get advanced access um, to my customers after seeing him um, allow founders basically to go in and test the platform and he agreed and thankfully he's going to offer this to us um, for a founder special of a one-off cost opposed from a monthly when it actually goes live. One of the reasons that I've been able to do that is obviously I have that relationship with Josh and I know that he creates great software and I really wanted to bring this to you at a great cost because I know it's going to be a, a winner when it actually goes live. So you've got the chance today to get access to this uh, months before uh, anyone else. You can test this out for yourself, you can um, use this in your campaigns and it's a full shopping cart solution which will basically give you the ability to take reoccurring monthly um, payments, it'll later integrate with PayPal and um, Stripe. It'll also allow you to set up your own affiliate platform so people can actually promote your products. And what that the important thing about that is that you can do it without fees. So JVZoo obviously has significant fees. With this platform, you won't have fees other than Stripe and PayPal with that. It also gives you the ability to really easily set up your products, set up check checkouts that are really high converting checkouts that Josh has tested. And it's a really complete software. Usually softwares like this, they charge $97 per month on average. And I believe that's what Josh is going to be releasing this as. But as a um, special, he's going to release it to us at 197. So you've seen this before anyone else. I think Josh has introduced his own subscribers to it, but um, other than that, uh, I, I think I'm the only affiliate other than maybe one other person he works with closely um, that is the ha has the ability to show you this. So I think this may be the last time that it'll be at a one-off cost. I'm not 100% sure. It's all up to Josh, but uh, I, I wanted to introduce you um, to this and give you a chance to get access before, uh, before it went live for a monthly cost. So let's hop across to my computer. I'll show you this in action, show you what it can do for your business and why you might want to have this in your business. And uh, yeah, I'll see you over there. Okay, so this is Thrivecart. Now this is the, um, after going through the walkthrough, now I've gone through and I've walked through the um, training uh, so first when you get into Thrivecart, they basically take you through some introductory training about how this can be used in your business. Now, the main way that you'd use Thrivecart in your business is to sell products. So you can apply this into your business to sell products. Um, you can sell affiliate products. Now, a quick thing about the affiliate product module of this, they're building it in right now. Okay, one of the reasons that um, you're getting in early is because, uh, and you're getting it as a one-off cost, is because they're still working on um, some of the features. There's still some features they're adding in, such as the affiliate dashboard. Now, there will be affiliate dashboard allowing you to promote your products um, or affiliates to promote your products through Thrivecart very soon. Um, it's not available yet, but uh, give it about, I, I believe Josh said about one to two months, and you'll have it in there. Now, um, when you go through, the key is to first of all start creating a new product. Now you can click create a new product and you'll be able to then go forward and create a new product. Now we're at this module right here. This is where we can create the product's name. So say for example that I wanted to you know, have my new product here. So I'm in the process of creating a new product and I'm going to be using this, um, this uh, Thrivecart for this product called Laptop Startup. Now Laptop Startup is basically a combination of training videos and training um, uh, platforms and software that we have uh, in one place. So let's go ahead, let's add our support URL. So for me, obviously it's sambackersupport.com. And then we can put in whether it's a software, whether it's coaching, video training course, physical product, um, and you can basically choose you know, uh, which category it might work as. You can choose whether you want this live, okay, so it can take sales right away. You can put this as disabled, so it's un un unavailable basically. Or you can put it in test mode, which test mode is really cool because you can test that the product is obviously working. Then after that, click next, and you've got your shipping and payment. Now, you can actually sell physical goods through this. You could sell books, you could sell uh, anything that you really wanted to uh, through this. Whether you have to ship it uh, digitally or whether you have to ship it you know um, to their address so you can collect certain data about this particular person so say for example I wanted to collect their name and um, when someone's making a purchase they obviously want to connect their name I'll be charging $97 monthly for this um, this system and actually it'll be probably $67 monthly and we can set a trial period of seven days. Now trial period is basically when you want someone to trial your product for seven days. So for this example, this particular product, I've been working on it for a long time. So I want people to be able to trial it to try it out for themselves because I think if more people trial it, more people will sign up because they like what they see. So you can do trial periods through this and this software will allow you to generate monthly reoccurring income. So then from there, you've got uh, your refund guarantee seal if you want to show that. And then you've got the option to collect the phone number 
uh, or the country. Okay, we can choose whether we want to collect the shipping address. I don't need to collect that for my um, in, in my case, so we can choose not to. Then from there, we add the success URL. Now, if you're using a membership system, uh, or if you're using Josh's membership system, which is uh, Wishlist, all right. Now, Josh didn't create Wishlist, but it's it's a system that um, that is really good. I use Wishlist in my business. I can integrate this with Wishlist. Wishlist is a WordPress um, membership system, uh, or you can just add your access URL, which might be, you know, for example, uh, slash slash laptop laptop startup dot com slash register for example uh, you you would obviously want to have it integrated if you can uh, and I believe they're adding in more integrations at the moment but um, yeah, you can do that. Also, you can ship your products through um, CD, DVD, or to your customers through a service called Kunaki, which is integrated with the system. So if you sell any physical CDs, DVDs, um, then Kunaki will basically send those out for you and it will integrate with Thrivecart really easily. Cool, then we go next, and we can ask, um, do we want to bump um, the offer to your customers. So um, do you want to have a bump product? Now bump product is kind of like an upgrade and I've seen Josh use this on Easy Video Suite uh, and what it basically is is say for example that someone goes to your checkout They've decided they want to purchase um, your video player or your you know white label audience drill software then what happens is you present them with an offer. Would you like to upgrade to developer rights? It might be only $19, but this is a way that you can do this without having to upsell them. It's all done through the shopping cart. So it's a really easy way of getting people to buy. And you'll find that conversions increase substantially from using this feature. It's a feature that I would love to use on JVZoo, but isn't available on JVZoo, all right? It isn't available on most shopping carts out there. Usually people have to build a custom solution for it. On this shopping cart, you can do that. So I might put developer rights to software. I could put in $47 for those. I could put in my lead text, um, developer rights uh, to software. Uh, upgrade to, to developer rights to software. Special time, um, special one time offer, $1.19 only. Now this is an actual one time offer, all right? This isn't a one time offer that people are only going to see once because if they purchase, then they don't upgrade, they're gonna have to pay more on the next page, all right? So it's a um, an actual one time offer. So you can see here, it has this, people will be able to tick this or it'll be automatically ticked and then from there, they'll be able to make the decision themselves to buy. We can then add our success URL for that particular thing. So it might be, um, you know, it might be laptop startup, startup.com slash uh, developer thanks. You know, it could be it could be an upgrade link, all right? An upgrade membership link, and again, you can ship out a CD or DVD. So it could be, hey, would you like an extra DVD free or a CD free with that? Then you've got the option to choose these checkouts. Now, this is one of the key features of the software Thrivecart. There are so many different softwares out there that don't have really good looking uh, custom checkout pages, all right? Checkouts are so important because they give the customer an experience. If you're selling a $1,000 product, for example, you want to have a custom solution like this because it will make you sell your product easier. Chris Record, for example, is a guy who uses these types of checkouts with his higher priced items. So what you're able to do with this is you're able to make it look a lot more professional, you're able to grab a lot more data like big companies do, and you're able to brand it as your own custom checkout, which is gonna help you increase conversions. You can add your box shot here, you can add your upload an image to display in your header, you can pick the different background colors that you want. You can complete the order. Um, you can check the different uh, buttons that you want. You can then go to checkout page and you can choose, you know, what is your name? All right, Sam Becker. Uh, or you can choose a testimonial, for example. So it might be that, you know, I might do this if I was, you know, uh, easy video suite is amazing. I would actually write that about Josh's other software because it was amazing. I could do the same thing about Thrivecart. And you can add in a multiple testimonials into that checkout page. That again increases conversions and it's an important factor when you're going and in, in using the software to, to make profit. So then from there, you can add another testimonial if you want, you can add another one, you can add multiple testimonials, you can customize this if you want. You don't have to add any at all. If it's a new product, you may want to you know not add any at all. Um, let me add in my image now. And you can see here that it's really easy to just add in um, the bits and pieces that you need. So there we are, I've added in my own testimonial and then I could put in bullet points into the sidebar as well. So you could say uh, quick and easy 
you could say, for example, uh, drag and drop software. Check out pages on the go. So you can see here, it's it's really quite easy to customize your checkout page. Then you've got the success page. Thanks for purchasing. Um, your product is ready. Then you can enter in a download, so a video. So you could say like, hey, welcome. Thank you for coming to the members area. I'm excited you've got access to Thrivecart. You could have a video URL here, or you could just choose that to leave that blank. And then you can add in the product's name here. So in this particular case, it might be Easy Video Suite. And um, then you know someone will be able to download my product. Then from there, you can add in tracking. You can actually track your pages and find out how many people are actually converting, um, whether they're buying, and what your conversion rates are. And you can make adjustments, changes to your testimonials, changes to the checkout page or the design of the checkout page in order to increase your conversions really quite quickly and really quite easily. Now, companies invest um, literally tens of thousands of dollars, maybe even more, maybe hundreds of thousands of dollars in some cases working on statistics based on the checkout page. So um, you're able to customize uh, you know, all of that, you're able to see clearly whether yours is converting, whether it's working or whether it's not, whether people are scrolling away um, from your checkout and if there's a problem you need to sort out. Then you can integrate it with your autoresponder to capture a lead when someone actually purchases. So again, you can integrate with Aweber, you can integrate with uh, MailChimp and it's really easy. All you need to do to authorize one of your accounts is um, click this and then it's gonna go take you to an authorization and you can go allow, okay, done. We can go back then and you'll see that it's been integrated. Aweber has been integrated. Now if you wanted to, you could um, then choose which list you want people to go to. You can choose when a customer buys the main product where they go to and you can customize exactly what happens to the customer afterwards. Have you ever heard of a product Marion Dice did called The Machine? Um, it's basically a system like this that uses um, basically different funnels, taking people into different funnels depending on which product they purchased. You can do this with a free trial, which is really, really big, because those free trial people, you can continue to engage them, and if they unsubscribe, then you can actually send them to another list. Um, you can, uh, you know, uh, add different, uh, you know, different um, uh, information here. So when a customer purchases the offer bump, they are going to also get added to another list. So you could add, choose, you know, one of the lists they get added to. Then you could choose another list they get added to um, where it engages them in a different way. You can delete these, you can choose not to use them, uh, but it's really easy and you can, and basically, it gives you the ability to, uh, and I should do this with Packers Board actually. So if a free member signs up, for example, then I can take them to a different list. If a paid person signs up, I can take them to a different list and send people to different pages based on what they've actually purchased and what type of person I think they are and what they might be interested in. I could also determine um, which list they go to uh, and send out a discount offer if um, you know they hadn't taken me up on the bump price I could send out a discount or a temporary discount for that and then after that you click payments now you can integrate this with Stripe you can integrate this with PayPal you can integrate this um, and, and also it, it'll calculate your um, sales tax which is pretty cool as well so I could get uh, you know, capture customer addresses and, and do all of that. Stripe is the main payment platform at the moment. I'm actually setting up my Stripe account right now and Stripe is a merchant. It's basically a way to avoid PayPal fees and it's a way also to um, easily monitor what's going on in your, in your website. If you haven't used Stripe before, it's a merchant that makes it so easy to take in money and it also provides data that other merchants don't. It's the biggest and fastest growing merchant right now in the marketplace and it is a great alternative to PayPal. But if you just have PayPal, again, you can authorize your PayPal. All you need to do is click a few buttons, and then immediately you've authorized your PayPal. There we are. I've now authorized my PayPal, and I can go back. Cool, so I've got a PayPal added, and I've got uh, my Aweber added. Now there's a number of other platforms you can also, or, or um, a number of other integrations you can also do. You can integrate with membership sites, payment gateways. Um, you can also integrate with the Thrivecard API, which plugs into other components. And again, I'll just show you these um, different current autoresponders. They're still adding more, but you can integrate with GetResponse. You can use GetResponse. You can use ActiveCampaign. You can use um, Infusionsoft. You can use MailChimp as well and build out your shopping cart. Now once you've finished, once you've successfully finished your shopping cart, um, this has a live statistics mode. It also has a test mode as well, so you can monitor your test sales, which is really cool and a feature that I haven't seen, but I wish other sites would bring in. 
Then from here, we can get the URL. Now when we get our URL, this is our Thrivecart shopping cart URL. It's really easy to use and it's really easy to add. Um, I wish that other platforms were like this, it would save so much time. Um, and you can create upsells as well. So look at this, check out this. All right, so this is how easy this is. All right, we click on this. I created a shopping cart. I created the page, the payment gateway, my buy button basically, within a matter of minutes. And there was no hassles. There was no, um, you know, running through complicated uh, variables or you know, the, uh, no complexities. It was really quite easy and standard. And here it is. So this product's in test mode, it, it shows me it's in test mode, which is great. I've got my upgrade page here. It adds it automatically to the order. And there we are. So I've got a one-off um, payment that's available. Quick and easy, drag and drop software, checkout pages on the go, and uh, this, and there we are, there's the testimonial. So I could add in bullets as well, more bullets here, I could add in more details to this, but it's gonna help it to increase my conversions, help people to sign up, and then once they go ahead, they can upgrade, they can pay, and there we are. So you've also got a monthly payment. So for example, it says here, today's payment for laptop startup is $67 and monthly payments are $1. So I did a mistake on that. First payment will be billed in 10, seven days. So what I can do to go back and fix that mistake, because I did make a mistake, is I can go back to my products. I can go back to edit product. And then I can go over to uh, my shipping and payment. All right, so upfront price is $1. Trial period is seven days. Subscription price is $67. Save and get URL. All right, so I've fixed the error. I've fixed the problem that I had. I can now go and refresh, and it will come up correctly. So it's another reason why we do um, the test sales as well. Today's payment, $1. Future payment, $67. If they tick this, today's payment is $48, and in future, it's $67. So you can see here the, the use of this software and, and how easy it is um, to fix mistakes if you make them. Uh, and also, you can add upgrades as well. So if I wanted to add an upgrade, I could put upgrade one, upgrade one, uh, laptop, start up platinum i can make this a 197 dollars cost one time fee i can click next i can then go through the process of updating the product add in the different products here and um, i can go through the same process that i've gone through before and set up a shopping cart now what will happen is that it will immediately after purchase it'll take someone to my page and this has one click upsell. So when someone actually goes to that upsell upgrade page, they're gonna see that one click upsell and they're going to be able to click on that one click upsell and purchase that one click upsell, all right? So there's no need to go through PayPal again. They click a button, they click a button and it adds that to their, their bill basically without having to go through the whole process of paying and logging into PayPal again. One click upsells increase conversion substantially. They also give people, um, and it lets them know it's a one click upsell as well, so it doesn't matter. No one's gonna get um, you know in trouble for doing this, but um, basically it increases conversion that makes the whole process a lot more smoother, and it's what big companies do. And previously you had to do this with Infusionsoft, you had to do this with monthly softwares. This software itself is gonna become a monthly, but because you're seeing this right now, it's going to be a one-off cost. There's also a number of other features being added in. There's an affiliate dashboard being added in. Um, you've got many customization options. You've got a bunch of different statistics options, but because you're getting access to this before anyone else, you're gonna be able to benefit from those as they're added to it as a founding member today for a one-off cost. So um, I'm sold. I, I love this software. Uh, I haven't seen a checkout software that's as easy to use as this and as good. This is really user-friendly. Um, you can get your campaign set up within a matter of a few minutes. It's far more easy than JVZoo. JVZoo obviously was created for different reasons. It's a marketplace, whereas this is created for larger softwares for um, you know um, high-priced items as well as if you're you know launching white-label softwares off off um, JVZoo or creating your own affiliate network, then this is um, a software that will really help to sell your products uh, much more efficiently and effectively. So I like the custom features. I like the fact you can customize the checkouts. There's more being added to it right now, and I encourage you if you if you like what you see, get access to this now at a 197 cost because it's going to go up in price and you'll get a lot of benefit out of this. So this is Sam Becker. Thanks for listening. I hope you've enjoyed this demonstration. I look forward to talking with you again soon. See you later.